won the Global Nations Cup 2024. Brazil, Japan, Germany, Iran, Poland, Montenegro, Sweden, Lithuania, USA, Ukraine, South Korea, Egypt, Finland, Denmark, Greece, Italy, Spain, 17 nations, three days, one winner. So time to time to check the eyelashes for our last game of today. Welcome back, Kevin. So now Brazil against Montenegro. Yes. Uh, <laughs> we have a big favorite here with Brazil, and we have a big underdog with Montenegro. But it's not always so easy. But Brazil, they really they said they want to win that title. They have scored in both matches they have played so far. They both in both matches they have scored 16 goals. So 32 goals scored already for Brazil. Of course, yes, they also um, got 15. So maybe you have your opportunities to score. But will Montenegro be strong enough to use those chances? They had that 10-10 against Poland after they have been 5-0 down. So maybe that will give them some confidence. And uh, Mirko, maybe you can tell us a bit about the starting lineups already, or? So yeah, we can talk about the starting line. So now um, to Brazil, starting with Dantas on the right side. In the middle will be Silva, uh, Emerson Silva. He, he gets this Emerson on his back, but uh, on our sheet it will be Emerson Silva so just for you to know and with a four on the left side Leomon Moreno and yeah Montenegro starts like last time with the two Nikolic with two Nikolic and number five Ranitovic so there's everything like the game before Good block there from the center from Marko Nikolic. Gives the ball to his brother. Or we don't know if it's his brother, Nikola Nikolic. And this was his first attack. Now Moreno fires from the half right position back to the center of Montenegro. And again, Nikolic, uh, Nikola Nikolic with the attacking from the right corner. Response was from Dantas. And now Marko Nikolic gives the ball to Ranitovic, with, which is a left-handed thrower from the left side. Good block from the center. Again is Emerson Silva. Gives the ball to Moreno, half li left, high bouncing ball, but do, does not lose that much energy. Ranitovic gives the ball to Nikola Nikolic and the ball was throwing out. So Marko Nikolic, so number two is the center of Montenegro and number five Ranitovic. So good ball, the ball went up high, got good, good blocking there from Ranitovic. First time Brazil really knocks on the door. Now Marco Nikolic, high bouncing ball, but no penalty here. Good blocking from the center from Emerson Silva. Gets the ball to Moreno, fires just a little bit cross, cross throw there. But then Nikolic found the gap and first goal, yeah. Nikola Nikolic. That's what I said, you will get opportunities to get through the Brazilian defense and there it is. 1-0 for the Montenegro team and the quick wow. response from Dantas. Don't do that again. That's what we wanted here. Directly answer of the first goal of the 
of this match. So Kranituic wants to answer quick. Good blocking there by the hands of Emerson Silva in the front. And now Dantas throws the ball, very quick ball, but blocked by the belly of Marko Nikolic. The ball gets now from Nika. Nikola Nikolic. High bouncing ball, but good save again from Emerson Silva with uh, number seven of Brazil. Now Moreno fires the ball to Nikola Nikolic. And first time out for Nama Montenegro. Well, so maybe, quick. Yeah, interesting. We don't see that often. But maybe the coach have, has seen something where he says, you have to know that or we are getting the danger of uh, opening some gaps or something like that, that there has to be a reason, I think. Um, I don't think it's like uh, get them some rest because then, then he does not have enough time out. But it's a good start for Montenegro. They really give Brazil some work to do and well, they are the underdog, but so far they fight with everything they have. I'm interested to see how long they can keep that up, because Brazil, of course, has always a few more gears. So, the attack was for Marco Nikolic, and it's ball over. So, the ball went out in the neutral zone. So, Montenegro has another opportunity here. The ball is on the left side by Rani Tupic. Just irritating noises. And now Rani Tupic. And the ball was long caught ball. long ball. Yes. So now Rani Tupic has to defend his goal against Moreno. Moreno was a good, good um, penalty shooter. He scored four games in his last one. And now he will take going. From the middle, blocked there by Ranitovic. Just good one there. I've told you before, Moreno just <laughs> scored really four times, four penalties, and now good blocking by Ranitovic. There, next attack by Nikola Nikolic, just lands by Dantas. Dantas now throwing to the right corner, good blocking there by Ranitovic. Who's blocked out the ball. So now he gets his ball back. 9 minutes 16 seconds left on the clock. Turning Antovic, throwing. Good block by Dantas. He gives now the ball to his teammate Moreno to the left side. Moreno turns, fires a quick ball. But good blocking there by uh, Marco Nikolic. And now Nikola Nikolic from the right side, again with a fast ball. So this game is really fast. Yes, um, and really quick, the time from the yeah. clock. <coughs> so many, many throws here by both teams, 1-1 one, one standing. And now Marko Nikolic with the long ball. Long ball. Yes. It was not that close caught long ball. Um, I didn't see that. But I'm not a referee, so Marko Nikolic has to defend it. the goal against Dantas. Dantas just rolling to the right corner and hits it! Well, you don't need that much pace if it's that accurate into the corner. It was nearly perfect and no chance for Montenegro for Marko Nikolic to defend that ball. High cross ball. Done. Good defending there by Brazil. The attacking from Nikola Nikolic went to the to the knee of Emerson Silva and then the ball crosses the crossbar. Touched it, but no goal there. And the attack was not that effective. So Again, Marko Nikolic with the defend. Ball jumps up, but no problem for Brazil to keep the ball in her hands. Emerson Silva blocked by Marko Nikolic. Gives the ball to the left side to Ranitovic. 
just turning, swings, but blocked by Emerson Silva in the front. No problem for him. And now Dantas from the right side. Bounce ball, but everything all right. Ball was blocked out. So now Montenegro had the chance to score. Nikola Nikolic with the throw blocked in front of Emerson Silva. Gets many balls in his hands. No problem for him. Emerson Silva there. Yeah, equipment it check. I think with official timeout, yeah. The attacking was number four, Moreno, from the left side. But a good blocking there from the Montenegro. So everything all right. The referee goes to the sideline. So the game can start again. Seven minutes, 33 seconds. Nikola Nikolic from the right. Bounce ball to Moreno. Moreno gets the ball and takes the next attack from the left. Bouncing ball to the right corner, but went out before the post. So no problem there for the team of Montenegro. Again, one, now number five, Hranitovic. Turning, throwing, bouncing ball, but no problem. Two teammates there, Emerson Silva and Moreno together, saves the ball. A good ball from Moreno, but good defending, better defending there from Hranitovic, who defends the ball with his legs, so now Gives the ball to Nikola Nikolic, who is standing at the center position, throwing. And again, good blocking there by the Brazilian team. Now Dantas and Moreno change the sides. Dantas now on the left, attacking side. And, Dant uh, and Moreno from the right. So. Again, official timeout to check the eyelashes. The player called called it, so is everything all right? Everything good, so now we can keep on. Marco Nikolic has the ball on the left side. Turning, throwing, got and again blocked by the center of Brazil. So now throwing to the right corner, but it went out before. So six minutes, 32 seconds left on the clock in this first half of our last game for today. 12 more tomorrow here, seven more on Sunday. Again blocked by Emma Silva in the middle. Throwing by Moreno, good blocking from the center. Marco Nikolic, who throws the ball back to his teammate Nikola Nikolic. Good bouncing ball, but again, good and better defending by Brazil. And again, Dantas throwing the ball long line, but really good defending there from Nikola Nikolic. And now from the center position, Marco Nikolic throwing to the left corner. And it's a ball over, so Montenegro has the chance to score another goal here. It's not a walk in the park for Brazil. They have to work really hard at the moment. You say it. So now Randy Tovic from the half left. Throw to Silva to the center position. And again, now Silva want to score, but good blocking there by the legs of Marco Nikolic, the ball went out on the right side, so now Nikola Nikolic gets the ball back and takes the ball, turning around, blocked by two Brazil players and again Dantas from the left side, didn't get the corner, good blocking there again by Marco Nikolic as the center now wants to attack again. Bounce ball, but there is no gap between the Brazil players. Now again, blocked ball 
by Montenegro. Nikolic bounced on the line. So the referee said no long ball. And now Moreno from the half left fires to Nikola Nikolic who gets the ball. And another timeout for Montenegro. Yeah, interesting. Another timeout. Means that they only have two left for the rest of this match in Brazil. They still have four. Yeah, an interesting, an interesting one here. Um, of course, you could ask Brazil. They they didn't use a penalty. It was blocked by Montenegro. That is um, has been a mistake. Um, and of course, it's their third game today. Montenegro has won less because they had problems with their travels, so maybe some advantage with the stamina for Montenegro, but Brazil, they are experienced enough, I believe. So now the clock starts by 40, uh, 4 minutes 40 seconds, blocked out by Brazil. And so we start again with Dantas from the left side, going to the left corner. Turning around, throws to the right corner. Good blocking there by Nikola Nikolic. Closes the right corner. At the left corner, sorry for that. Nikola Nikolic now from the center. Position, bounced, ball, and he scores! Oh, yes. Maybe the timeout was exactly the right thing. They not go away. It's just like a fly. You. You you hit you you want to want it to go away, but it doesn't. It was a diagonal shot from Nikola Nikolic, um, really to the left corner. Yes. And um, there was um, Moreno, who has not the close close to the corner, so um, has not touched the ball. But really perfect shot there from Nikola Nikolic. And now we have a substitution on the Brazil side. So um, we talked about Dantas. Now Dantas is on off the field and Saturnino takes his place on the right attacking side. And Moreno is now on the left attacking side. So now number five. Kanitovic wants to shoot the Long line shot, but blocked by Saturnino. And again, Saturnino just turning, throws with lots of energy, blocked by the feet from Marco Nikolic. And the ball was going out, so good blocking there, effective blocking. Marco Nikolic now wants to attack from the left side, half left. He throws, blocked by Emerson Silva, who's taking. The center position, high bounce ball to the right corner, but blocked by Ranitovic. Now Ranitovic gives the ball to Nikola Nikolic, who throws the ball outside, so no problem there for the Brazilian team. No one has to defend that. So now the ball is back in the game by Moreno, just turning, forcing the right corner, but the ball is out. Tip. So, no problem there. Panitovic gets the ball back on the left attacking side. Goes a little bit more to the middle. Just turning, hits the ball to the center position. No problem for Emerson Silva. He's really good in getting balls to the center. Just throwing it to the center position of Montenegro. Marko Nikolic blocked the ball out. So again, the ball coming back to his brother. Maybe his brother. Nikola Nikolic with the next attack. Long ball. ball. No, no okay. long ball. It sounded like a no long ball sorry. for them. It, it looked like nearly, but um, the referee didn't get it or didn't saw it. I don't know exactly. So now blocked out by Brazil. Saturnino gets the ball. 
to Moreno. He now from the half right side throws it. Good blocking there by Martinovic. Ranitovic. Ranitovic gives it to Nikola Nikolic, who's forcing the left corner like he scored before. And again, Brazil was the counter, but the ball is over. So again, Brazil wants to take one shot. Satonino gives the ball to number nine and uh, number four, sorry, to Moreno, and he forcing the right corner. Got good blocking there from Ma Ranitovic. Ball is back in the game. Two minutes, 30, 36 seconds left here. So again, Nikola Nikolic wants to attack here. Blocked by Satonino. Satonino now got gets to the center position, turns, swings, but the ball was blocked out by Montenegro by standing 2-2 here in the last game in the first half of the match. Yeah, I'm sure that the Brazilians didn't imagine that it could be so difficult here against Montenegro. But it is. They really have to dig deep. So the ball kicked out by Marco Nikolic. And the three players by Montenegro played the whole game before. Yeah. So no substitution there. Quick response now from Emerson Silva and he gets the gap. Yeah, one moment where they have been, the Montenegrinos have been just a bit too slow and then they couldn't close that gap. Gap between Santel, Marko Nikolic and Ranitovic on the defending left side. Good blocking again from Brazil. Satonino now on the left side, turning, swinging, but Marco Nikolic gets the hands on the ball, so good defend there. Now again, Nikola Nikolic with the ball, but defended by Emerson Silva in the middle. And again, oh, and again the score by Brazil. It's like number four, Moreno. They just needed one moment and now it seems like they are there and jumping all over it. So now it's 4-2 for Brazil. Nearly to the half time here in the game. Martinovic, Ratinovic blocked by Emerson. Emerson wants to shoot again, very quick. And good blocking there by Marco Nikolic, who wants to score the next goal. The ball lost a little bit of energy in the way. The ball really from Sartonino hits out by his first touch on the ground. So one minute left here in our game in the first half. So now Nikola Nikolic from the left side wants to shoot to Santonino. Santonino just fires back but blocked out by Ratinovic. Ranitovic. Ranitovic gets the ball back on the left side. Goes a little more to the middle. And then Again, turning, shoot, blocked by Moreno on the left side, on the right defending side from Brazil, and again, again blocked, quick response from Nikola Nikolic, blocked by Emerson Silva, Emerson Silva gives the ball back to Moreno, and again Moreno fires it, hits the line, good defending there by Nikola Nikolic, Puts his leg on the ball and the ball went over the crossbar. Didn't touch it, but it was a good chance for Brazil here. And now again Nikola Nikolic with the next throw. Blocked by Satonino. Silva gets the ball, throws it. Good defending by both Nikolic. And again, number four, Nikola Niklic wants to score, kicked out, was the ball over, but it's half time here. 4 2 lead for Brazil. Yeah, I expected it a 
bit clearer, but the first goal was went to Montenegro, and after that it was a real open fight, both trying everything, Montenegro giving it all, especially defensively, and Brazil really had their struggles. I think there have been two mistakes from Montenegro, both these penalties, these long balls. Brazil missed one, but also scored one, and that was the one that brought them back into the game to all. And then they had that counter-attack where Montenegro had that little gap. They haven't been fast enough. Just one moment, and then it was the, the third goal, and they used it. That just that, that one moment to score also a fourth one. Well, you can see Brazil has control, but Montenegro, they are still hanging in there. It, it still feels like Brazil could keep the control the longer the game goes on. But for me, really big respect for Montenegro for what they are showing at the moment, especially with their background of not knowing when they would be able to be here and the first game they lost because they couldn't play, they still have been on their way here to Berlin. Yeah. 4-2 Brazil, the world champion, the Paralympics champion, the Pan American champion. What else? They won everything. They are on track for their third win. The first match they won 16-9 against Iran. The second they won 16-6 against Germany. Well, it's still much to do if they also want to score 16 goals in this one because they have only four so far. Yes, we will see. So now we see some substitution there on the Brazil side. So um, two new players are on the pitch. So um, Sato, Satonino takes place on the right attacking side. Then we have number five, Jose Marcio Sousa. And we have number two, Luciano Batista. In the middle, taken as a center position, would be Jose Marcio Sousa and on the left attacking side number two Batista and no surprising at the Montenegro side they are staying like they did before it's really tough if you have to play all that all the time all the time together and but but you you also know each other really well course. Yeah, referee telling us the substitutions. Right. Yes. So one half left on this first day of the Banda Bull Bull Nations Cup in the capital in Berlin. So now Montenegro takes the first shot and it's Nikola Nikolic from the half right turning. Searching the left corner, but the ball was blocked out by Satonino. Gets the ball back. Gives it to the center position, to number five, to Sousa. Wants to go take his first shot. And he finds again! Yeah, sometimes you do the right things, you do the right decisions as a coach. And maybe this was the one. Just getting someone in with, with, a, with another throwing action. And now the number five of Montenegro oh. scores. Danitovic. It was really close because two player of Brazil get his hands on the ball, but not that to pretend it for the goal line, so it crossed it over and we have a 3-5 for on the side for Montenegro. So just a two-goal lead there by Brazil. And this is also some kind of success. Just saying, we we keep there. We 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 don't go away. Now Marco Nikolic and 
Long ball. Long ball, definitely. Ooh. We saw it, so. Risking too much, saying, yeah, now we want another goal back. And, well, chance for Brazil. To score. So, who, who will make it? Now, Saturnin will get the ball in his hands. And Marco Nikolic goes to the right corner. Brit Long oh. ball for Saturnino. But we can say Marco Nikolic has this knee on the ball and this went up high and just pretend his goal line went over the crossbar. So first penalty for Montenegro. Now Nikolic. On the left corner, searching it, and good pretending there from Saturnino. I think he got his hands on, but the accuracy from Nikola Nikolic was too perfect. He wants to get the left corner, and he missed it. It was so close here to get one goal for Montenegro. So now blocked. The ball was blocked out. No, ball over. Sousa with the shot and the blocking by Marko Nikolic goes over the middle line. So again, ball over and time for Brazil. Again, Sousa from the center post. And again, good blocking there by Marko Nikolic by his, his breast, giving it to Nikola Nikolic. And again, I thought it was... I thought it was a long ball but uh, the referee didn't get it. So again, now from the left corner, Batista and another block. Oh, it was so close, blocked out, lucky for Montenegro. It's what nearly like ball over. So again, Nikola Nikolic from the right corner, bounce ball to the right side, blocked out by Saturnino. 5-3, standing for Brazil. Nearly two minutes played in this game. In the second half, good block there by Marco Nikolic, who's going to the left corner. Turning around. Good block there by Saturnino again. So just long ball, a uh, long line shot there from Marco Nikolic. And now Saturnino from the middle right side. Ball to Nikola Nikolic, who gets the ball. Just goes three steps behind, throwing to the middle. And Sousa, good defending there. Shoots, blocked before, blocked to the front from Rajitovic, who gets the ball back from Marko Nikolic. And turning, throwing to the right corner, but no problem for Saturnino to defend it. So, again. Oh, I, I thought it could have been a long ball, but it was out. Yeah, before it went out at the middle line. So, now the chance for Montenegro to score their fourth goal. Panitovic from the left. Turning, throwing, good blocking there by number two, Batista. And again, Sousa with a shot from the middle, blocked by the feet from Marko Nikolic to Nikola Nikolic, who gets the ball again. Throwing massive shot, and he scores oh. again! Well, they don't have anything to lose, and that makes them really dangerous. They wouldn't play that good against other teams, maybe. Brazil tries to answer, but a good block there. from Montenegro. Again, Marco Nikolic as a center position. And again, Ranitovic now with a slingshot with left hand. But Sousa gets the ball, gets to the center position. Much energy, again blocked by the center of Montenegro, Marco Nikolic. Does a good, great job here. And again, Nikola Nikolic, blocked again by Sousa. And now, from Sousa, the ball gets to Saturnino. Turns, throws a quick shot, but again blocked by Marco Nikolic. And Marco 
catch now from the right corner. Throwing. Didn't find a gap. Good good defending there by Batista. Who gets his feet closed. And Marco Nikolic again with the block. In the front. Nikola Nikolic with the next attack. Sousa has to be quick with the ball. Gives it to Satonino. High bouncing ball, but no problem there for defending for Montenegro. Well, the game gets quicker. So again, Ranitovic now. Swing shot, good closing gap there. Satonino and Sousa closes the gap between them. And again, Sousa from the middle. And he gets no gap. It, it looks like. And again, it's a timeout from Montenegro. The third one. Yeah, they really. Now I really think something like the coach wants to give his players some kind of break. Because you need so much energy to play to play against Brazil, to have that focus on the defense, to do it time and time again. You can't just be off one second because then they will punish that and they do it really good and two things are in shape here two things are a factor one is that brazil is playing the third game on a day and that is really much for goal ball and the other is that montenegro i just said it before they have nothing to lose they are the underdog and they just say we give you a game whatever it takes yeah so close right beside that so Nikola Nikolic wants to take the first shot. Good collecting block there by Brazil. And now Saturnino wants to shoot by from him. Good blocking again by Marko Nikolic. And now Ranitovic from the right side, uh, left side with the left handed. Blocked out ball by Brazil. Official timeout. Checking the eyelashes of Montenegro's Nikola Nikolic. So everything was all right. And now again, Brazil from the left, from the right side. Batista gets the ball. He's now firing from the right side to pretend to get the right corner. But Ranitovic is there, can block the ball and gives it back. Now to Nikola Nikolic, who's going to the right, half right position. But high ball, high ball, long, long ball, ball. Sorry for that, long ball by Nikola Nikolic. What a good bounce, but it was too long, so it didn't hit in the neutral zone. So again, Nikola Nikolic against number five, Sousa. Sousa fires. <laughs> Long line shot from the right side in the right corner and Nikola Nikolic just, just staying in his right corner, so the opposite. So next score for Sousa here. It was the fourth penalty and the second scored, so 50% record at the moment for Brazil here. So Marco Nikolic wants to take the next shot but blocked by Sousa and Sousa answers. And this block was by Nikola Nikolic. So now again Nikola Nikolic from the half right side. Again, good, good one yeah, for a goal fights. again. It's risky what he does and not for the first time it was on the edge of being a long ball. But sometimes it's really good and then it's a goal. So Saturnino wants to answer quick with a goal, but again blocked by Marco Nikolic, who takes the next faking. shot. Yeah, good faking there. High ball was a good defended by Sousa. The block goes out. A little bit luck there for Brazil. Now Batista from the left. And again blocked by Marco Nikolic in the middle. Again, fake from Marco Nikolic. Anitovic with a swing shot, turning and then throwing. But again, defending by Brazil. Saturnino with the next attack. 
a little bit like that. Nikolic get a hand on this ball. Just was rolling on the field. And again, Nikola Nikolic with a good ball, high bouncing ball. And a quick shot there from Batista. It really looks like a high ball. Yeah. But like throwing a last mm. time out from Antonego. We have Quite six early. minutes left on the clock. Yeah, that's so can be whew. That can be a factor if you are Brazil and thinking, well, we are experienced enough, we have the quality, we don't take one because then you don't get the breaks you maybe need. need yeah. Interesting, but also interesting. The last regular goal from Brazil was six minutes ago at the start of the second half. Right. For six minutes, Montenegro didn't receive a goal um, apart from that penalty. So yeah. that also is really respectable. Yeah, you say it, is what it was a penalty from Sousa. Yes. Um, Strider had long line shot from the right side to the right corner. Now Rancic. Search a gap between Saturnino and Sousa, but didn't find it. Now Sousa gets the ball back. He has not much time to fire the ball. Beside and good blocking there by Nikola Nikolic. From his hips, the ball gets a little bit up high and touches the crossbar and went over it. Looks good. Good defending there. And now Marco Nikolic from the middle. Shoots, blocked out by Sousa. And now Saturnino gets a chance from the right corner. Swing shot to the left, good blocking there by Nikola Nikolic, who takes the next shot from the right side. Good ball blocked by the breast of Sousa, out. Five minutes, 29 seconds left. Still only one goal between. Still advantage Brazil, but just slightly. Brazil has four different goal scorers in this game. The ball went out from Batista at the right side. And Montenegro, Hanitovic, Mon, Nikola, Nikolic, four goals. And now Marco Nikolic from the left corner in the front. And wow. quick response there by Sousa. But again, brilliant block by Marco Nikolic. And now Ranitovic from the left side, forcing the light, the left corner. Now Satinino wants to get a shot blocked by Marco Nikolic. I can talk that Marco Nikolic <laughs> blocked nearly 90% from every, <laughs> every ball here from shooting from uh, Brazil. Now the block blocked out by um, number five. Official timeout because Granitovic wants to check their eyelashes. He defended the ball with it. So, and these official timeouts are now important because they don't have own timeouts and they don't have uh, the opportunities to regain, just to refocus, to refresh. Yeah, you said it. Five minutes, 40 seconds left. Granitovic with the ball, but Batista now going to shoot to the left corner. Good pretending there together. Granitovic and Marco Nikolic. Now Nikola Nikolic Oy. takes the ball but blocked by Saturnino. Blocked out. So again now Saturnino from the right corner. Forcing a quick ball but again blocked by Marco Nikolic. The attack was going now from Nikola Nikolic. No high ball, no long ball. Quick response by Sousa. And again, Marko Nikolic with a block in the middle. Now Nikola Nikolic from the right side. Blocked by forcing the left corner. So diagonal over the field. Yeah. But no, ch no chance, no goal here. Saturnino blocked the ball up. They keep them busy. They are still dangerous, Montenegro. So now Batista from the right side. Quick response, blocked out by Ranitovic. This hey. is a great game. This is brilliant to watch. 
Yeah, there's no gap here. So now Randy Twitch from the half left was left handed. Turning, swinging, high bounce balls, two diagonal over the field. But again, blocked now by Batista. Batista gives the ball to Tatinino, a good blocking ball, and Marco Nikolic gets the, his legs together to hold the ball between. And now, oh, it was close. Close to the high ball. But everything all right. The ball was blocked out. So Batista now from the left side gives the ball to Sousa. Sousa just a little bit more to the right side. Turning, swinging, blocked shot, blocked out by Nikola Nikolic on the left. So no, now Nikola Nikolic gets the ball back. And again, turning, swinging to the middle. There's Sousa, who blocked the ball. Now but it gives it to Batista. Slingshot blocked by the shoulder of Marco Nikolic, and it went oh. out. Luck, much luck there for Montenegro. But sometimes you need that, especially against a world champion. It was really close to the post there. But now good double save by Brazil from Sousa and Batista. Now Saturnino from the right corner. Oh. The ball went out really, really fast. Now also fast. Some, some lost focus here. Brazil, that's not typical that the ball is out that early. A new possession for Montenegro. Now again, Nikola Nikolic from the half right, blocked by the feet of Sousa at the center position. Now Sousa goes back, turns, fires to Marco Nikolic, who gets the ball, gives it back to Nikola. And now he has the shot again. Swing shot blocked by the breast of Sousa. Ball went not out, so the time is running, the 10 seconds clock here. Batista was a quick response there for the 10 seconds went out. So now Nikola Nikolic take his time, take a breath, and there is a goal! Oh my, they are back! Incredible! Close to the 10 seconds! Nine, they have been on nine seconds. I thought, oh my, close, but what a goal. Six, six, two minutes, nine seconds on the clock. So now Sousa fires back. Marco Nikolic gets the block in the front. What a game here. It's so close. And again, Nikola Nikolic. And again, same gap. Oh my! Seven, six, Montenegro in front. Who saw that coming? Brazil is substituting. And, and we, we got some voices from Nikola Nikolic. <laughs> he shouted at us. <laughs> and so number four Moreno comes back to the um, back to the court. Yeah. Yeah, we are so emotional because we didn't expect it that. Yes. We we talked um, before from a break up here from Mercy Roo. Um, but we didn't expect it. So. And, uh, and this means now Brazil, Moreno, he's a key player. Getting him back in shows Montenegro the biggest respect he could get. And now an official timeout, equipment check. <laughs> By number five, Sousa, right? It's the Friday evening. Some people would maybe go out to, to have a party, <laughs> but we are here at 9.20 German time and follow maybe one of the biggest sensations of the last few years. In call ball. So the ball is in the hand of Brazil. Now comes back to the game. Moreno on the left attacking side. But we have to swiffer the ground because the Brazil people are a little bit sweaty. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so they, they, they have to work like I said before. <laughs> It's really tough for them, and now they need two goals. So, n so now again, the ball would be placed in the game, so everyone knows where the ball is. How much time is left on the clock? One minute, f 55 seconds. And blocked there, Moreno's shot by Nikola Nikolic. Montenegro one in front. And there's the good blocking by Saturnino. Official timeout. Eyelashes Brazil again by... 
Nikola Nikolic, sorry for that. Just to let you know, Brazil has still four timeouts. <laughs> Brazil has four timeouts, but he, they don't, um, they cannot take all four in one half. Yes, they can only take three. three. You're right. right. You're right. I'm sorry. So another Next substitution. substitution. Yeah, number five Sousa goes down the field, and Emerson Silva comes back. Emerson Silva scored in the f uh, in the game before, nearly six, seven goals. Um, for Brazil, so I think it's another key player, but only one minute 45 seconds left. Of course, that's Brazil. enough to score two goals in goal ball, but they have to. They come cold from the bench. That's not easy. So now Moreno from the half left, bounce ball, good blocking there by Marco Nikolic, blocked out. Yeah, four seconds or something away from the 10 second clock, but. Now Benjovic on the left side, turning, facing, blocked ball by Silva. Quick response, he's now the center position. Ball went up high, but Renitovic gets the second block there. First block was by Marco Nikolic. And now again, blocked by Mark, by Emerson Silva. And long, long ball. ball. Long what ball called. A chance. Long ball called by Moreno. So they missed one. They had only one penalty. And Brazil so far. And this is the second, and that shows us that they have to take more risk. So now Nikola Nikolic, the player of the game, maybe left side standing there, throwing to the left corner, and again he's oh. out. Oh, it's incredible! It's again out, the oh same my. way he did before. Take a deep breath for the last one minute, 15 seconds. Emerson Silva with the shot from the right side blocked by Marco Nikolic. And Marco Nikolic want to take the attack. Blocked by Emerson Silva in the front. Quick response from him, blocked again by Marco Nikolic. And it's ball over, so Brazil has the chance to come back here. Oh <sighs> my, but... So now, Satunino from the right side, right corner. He's turning. Good big bounce, but Nikola Nikolic gets a big, big save here. And throwing the ball out on the left side. I think he wanted it diagonal, but a bit yeah. too far. Right. So 40, 48 seconds left on the clock. Montenegro, one goal for. Maybe Brazil gets his first lose here in this tournament. Ball was blocked out by Ranitovic. And again Ranitovic want to shoot from the left side with the left hand. A little bit of irritation from Nikola Nikolic. Turning swing. Blocked by Sousa. Uh, uh, sorry by Silva. Gives the ball to Moreno. Moreno now turning, shooting to the right corner. It was really close. close yes. He had an idea, it nearly worked, but still one goal in front for Montenegro. Would you believe it? How much time? 25 seconds. Nikola Nikolic from the half right position. Turning around, shoots to the left corner, blocked by Satonino. Time out, Brazil! This is the biggest um, recognition for what Montenegro has done tonight. Brazil takes the first time out. What is it, 16, 15 seconds? 17 seconds. 17 seconds, so that means Brazil will throw quickly. Then Montenegro will save it and will try to put the 10 second clock down as much as possible. Just to say it, even a draw, even a 7 7 would be a big success for Montenegro. They have been relegated from Pool A in the European Goalball Championship. But now they are here and showing so much passion and dedication and fighting spirit. The biggest of respect. I never saw that coming. What do I know? So now let's last 25 seconds of this game. Satonino from the center. Blocked by Ranitovic and Marko Nikolic. Ball oh. over again. 11 seconds on 11 the clock. 11 seconds. That so. is... Oh, if well. So now Moreno has an action, scores to the left corner, but it went out. And they can hold the ball. They don't have to throw. Montenegro, they don't. Eight have 
seconds. Eight seconds. Seven, three, four. Montenegro. Seven, six. Nikolic. Take, take his time. Yeah, he takes the time. He does not throw. He does, he does not, not throw. throw. Illegal coaching, Brazil. So the coach spoke when he had... What the the they they decline the, the penalty. I, I describe it when yeah, it's over. The time I describe is over. it. It's done. It's, it's done. done. Oh Montenegro my. It's wins. incredible. Scenes. This is the world champion. What this is the Paralympics surprise. champion. And they've lost against Montenegro. What a surprise here. And just to, to I got goosebumps. Yeah, it's sorry for that. Well, we've, it's we've just seen a slice of gold ball history. I'm not sure when or if we will see. This is the world champion. This is the Paralympics champion. And they have lost 7-6. Just to describe you, this thing with that penalty, um, there was that illegal coaching, meaning that Montenegro would have had a penalty. But there is a rule that you don't have to take that penalty. They declined it. They say, we don't want to have it. We just want to have the ball. And they did exactly that. That was clever. That was the right decision. They have been down most of the time in this game, but I think two or three minutes before the game was over, they managed to score. They managed to get the lead. And they threw everything in. So many defensive plays, so many brilliant actions. That is. And Nikola Nikolic. I'm lost for words. That is. Nikola Nikolic with six goals of form seven. What a performance from him. Um, I, I have all the time goosebumps. Um, such sensational win from Montenegro against Brazil. Uh, it, it's over. It, so it's hard to. to <laughs> we could sit here and talk about the game two hours now afterwards, but we, we have to find conclusion here um, yeah <laughs> Brazil they didn't play bad I think of course it was their third game today but Montenegro also I'm not sure if we will see Montenegro ever play that good this was historical for them of course wow wow wow, 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 wow. so we are over <laughs> in Hall B uh, Gym B yes so um, in Gym A there is a a game played now so um, yeah is that still going on or is it it's finished? still going on Be so um, I saw a message on my phone so they uh, maybe till 10 they will play there if you have not enough after this game after 13 matches after 13 hours or so on you could switch over to gym a if not you could do what we do, leave, go to bed, have a cup of tea or whatever. And we are back tomorrow at, well, 8 o'clock for another bumper day here at the Wanda Nations Cup Gold Ball. But just to let it sink in, Brazil has just lost 7-6 against Montenegro. Kevin Bart and Mirko Schulze. We say Wish good you a good night. See you tomorrow. See you.